Welcome. Today we will show you a few things you should keep in mind when setting up the e-mobility portal for the SMA EV Charger business. After commissioning the SMA EV Charger business and configuration via the user interface, the product is ready for operation. X Factory two RFID cards are already configured. They can be used to authorize and activate the charging processes. It is important that these technical requirements are met for setting up the e-mobility portal. First, the SMA EV Charger business is ready for operation. Second, the SMA EV Charger business is configured and is connected to the Internet. A one-time setup must be carried out in order to use the SMA e-mobility portal. To accomplish this, various master data and data of the SMA EV Charger business are required. SMA service will take care of the setup for you. All required information must be entered in the provided form. You can find the form in the download area under service form. Your information will be treated in accordance with applicable data protection regulations. The following information is required. Name and address of your organization. The location where the SMA EV Charger business is installed. Contact details of a contact person in your organization. Name and contact details of the installation company. Indication whether a Sunny Portal account already exists. We also need some technical information for the configuration of the SMA EV Charger business in the SMA eMobility Portal. The serial number. You can find these on the type label of the product. Data for the electrical connection. The number of line conductors usually AC 3 phase, the grid voltage, fuse protection, protective device in ampere and the product type. After the onboarding you can make the settings in the e-mobility portal. Activate public charging and set the tariff. Allow charging without authorization card. Set up access groups and other RFID cards. The completed form must be sent to SMA service at onboarding minus emobility at sma.de. Following the setup, you will receive a confirmation email. Enter your name, phone number, and the password for your user account. Then confirm the terms of use and the data protection declaration to complete the registration. You will now be directed to the SMA eMobility portal and can use it to its full extent for your company and your already configured SMA EV Charger business. If you already have an SMA eMobility portal access and would like to add further SMA EV Charger business, please use the same form stating your company data, your contact details, as well as the required technical data for the new SMA EV Charger business. If your installation company already has access to the SMA e-mobility portal, they can help you with adding new SMA EV Charger business. We hope that this video could help you with your questions. If you need any further assistance, check out other tech tips on our channel or comment your questions below this video. Would you like to receive the latest tech tips on SMA products? Then subscribe to our channel.